Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, I've got a special one for you. This is a 2023 Grand Design Imagine AIM, model number 16 ML. It's a great, short, nimble couples trailer for you, weighing around 3,800 pounds or so. This is that eye for an eye. This is love you living by the law of the jungle. And I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hannemeyer on the camera today. Say hello, Brendan. How's it going, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for tuning in to the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. You should smash and click that like and subscribe button. We're also on Instagram, we're on TikTok, and we're on Facebook. Having fun on all the platforms, so you should follow us along there as well. We're going to put out a sweet TikTok on this bad boy. Grand Design has destroyed the aims. They're amazing. We really, really enjoy them. The inside interior, it's going to blow you away. You got to leave some comments. Let us know what you think about it. Enjoy the video. Right on, Brandon. Great intro, buddy. Front power jack, 20 power paint tanks, and then right behind there is going to be your battery and your box. This does have a solar kit coming on them standards. It's a 200 watt solar panel on the roof. We've also got Asdell for the walls on this, bringing some weight down. It's also a composite material, so there's no wood in the walls at all, which is pretty slick. Pass through storage right through there to the other side. We got our city water connection, also our fresh water fill right through here, outside shower. We got the prep for the tire pressure monitoring system, a receptacle, battery disconnect, and right there's your solar charge controller. Four manual stabilizer jacks on this guy. Our holder for our sewer hose is right there. We got 15 inch tires, aluminum rims. Look at those mudder tires, Brendan. They look hot. They look knobby, buddy. We got our sewer drain down through there with our black water flush kit. Coming around the back side here, 30 amp detachable style cord roof ladder get up on the roof check your seals every 90 days then on the door side or the oh we got some more going on here brandon we got ourselves a furion gas on-demand water heater outside spray port with a little class 2 receiver down through there put a little bike rack a little bike rack a little tote this is slick brandon popping this up we've got our griddle we pull out like so flip this guy over Cooking with gas. Cooking with gas, baby. Good size. It's not overly deep, but we can definitely get a couple different things going here. There's a drip tray. You hook that up down below. That's slick. Furnace vent. Our other tire. Then we got our secondary freshwater fill with an outside receptacle. Lend a hand grab handle. Three steps up and into the trailer. Secure to the ground. We got LED lights in the awning. We got full length awning, Brandon. It couldn't be any longer on a 16 foot travel trailer. Let's see what we got going on here for travel access. The answer is we got everything. We can uh, we can get to the bed, we can get to the couch, we can get to the kitchen, the fridge, the toilet, even wash our hands, everything you need for travel access. Let's get this thing popped open. Right on folks, we're inside that 16 ml 16 foot travel trailer and look at the floor space we got in man we can have a dance we can do a do si do we can do all of the whatever it's called square do, dancing yeah square dancing yeah. all the moves all the moves buddy lots of room in through here our bed is a sideways queen up here at the front we can get around the end of it and that does obviously shorten the trailer up for us um, we've got a lot of storage on this bed though, Brandon. We've got all these cupboards here down below. With shelves. With shelves in there. Oh, Ooh, look at that one. Cubbies. Cubbies for the shoes. Big fan of that. we got two drawers down here at the end of the bed. Wardrobe right there. Hucks. And then we got these big tall uh, cabinets here at the top, across the top of the bed. That's slick. So you're right, Brendan. We got these three hooks here, but then check this out down here. Two more hooks no for keys, maybe a dog leash, whatever you want to do in through there. We've got the Compass Connect system. Hang on, stuck. Compass Connect system here, where you can hook up to your phone, operate your slide, your awning, some of your lights right from your phone. That's super slick. And then look at this kitchen cabinetry we got going on. So look at the size of these drawers. Big drawers in through here. Top to bottom, we got a big pot and pan drawer down through here. Great, that's also where your manuals are, that's cool. Cupboard here, 
where that's also hiding your breakers and your fuses, but good space there for a small garbage can perhaps. Seamless countertops in through here across the whole length. A couple door side windows, two burner stove top with that pretty handy uh, uh, glass stove top cover that turns into a backsplash. This also is gonna turn into your uh, kitchen sink for a small little trailer, that's pretty mint. Plates and cups across the top here. Just keeps going, buddy. More shelves. All right. And this is a convection microwave. Thank you, Brendan. Our TV is up here to our left, which happens to be directly across from our couch slash couch dinette. Now, coming across from the kitchen, we've got our, what'd you say it was? 6.2? 6.2 12 volt fridge right there with a freezer down below. Nice handy chest freezer too, right? Easy to get the things Very like clever. that. You're not gonna lose the pierogies in the bottom. We've got our- More storage. More storage, golly, look how deep that is. You can get your platters in there, Brendan. Fitting all the cocoa puffs. All the cocoa puffs. Nice uh, uh, blank wall here, but you know what's cool? There's a little bit of a bonus USB there. And then here's our slide. This makes all the difference in the world. Pulls our couch off the floor. Large drawers underneath the couch. Comfortable couch to sit out. I believe we have some cup holders here. That's bingo bango. And then we got the table. The table's easy to set up. Fold. Lock. Fold. Lock. You gotta make sure to lock the locks. <laughs> okay, I did lock them, Brandon. Yeah, I know you did, I know but you didn't add the steps. Yeah, but this play-by-play -play action <laughs> is just a little... I know you just watched the Super Bowl and all that, but... Yeah. That's great, right? And that's adjustable, so you wanna make it a little bit higher, you can. You can also have it down as a coffee table. Pretty slick in through there. And then we have a rear bath, Brendan, so you know this thing's gonna rock. We got our toilet here. Let's see how the dump truck fits. Great space for the hips in through here. Nice sliding door so you're not wasting any space. Look at the size of these drawers. <laughs> they juke me, buddy. <laughs> Look at the size of the drawer faces and then nice small drawers right behind so it. So cute. <laughs> <laughs> Towel bar, stainless steel sink, double medicine cabinet. You saw the hooks, Brennan? It didn't show them up. Look at those. More hooks. And then we do got plugs down there. Great work, buddy. Nice window here in the washroom, too. I'm six feet tall. All six feet of me fit in here nicely. Nautilus style door, 16 foot trailer. Are you kidding me? Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the uh, notification button maybe even. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.